Good evening, this is Jan. I'm right here in my kitchen where I'm gonna cook stump. Now what is stump? It's the traditional Belgian potato and vegetable stew which I'm gonna cook using broccoli because broccoli is very healthy plus it got lots of flavors which I like. I'm gonna start with boiling the potatoes which I'm gonna mash later on with the vegetables. First up it's the broccoli of course. So I'm gonna cut these trunks loose. them into smaller pieces, something like this, and then anyway I'm mashing this up with the potato so all the flavors will be everywhere in this stew, in this stew. Couple of red onions for extra flavor just chopped up roughly put some butter in my stew pan I put the red on in the broccoli as well plus some Cloves of garlic, which I sliced already. Then I'll add some herbs and spices. Never forget about spices and herbs, of course. A little bit of salt, lots of black pepper. I'm a big fan of black pepper, as you know. And then some oregano, which goes very well with the broccoli. I'm going to add the potatoes. And it's going to be a stew. I don't actually have a real device to uh, mash these potatoes, so I'm just using this spoon. Because these are boiled already, this is working. So yeah, it's going to be mushed, not too much, but just enough. Going to add some more butter for the creaminess, plus a cup of cold water, so that nothing gets burnt. Actually, could add some stock, vegetable stock, chicken stock, any stock, but I'm using plain water because I want to have the real flavor of the broccoli, you know, and the onion and the potato itself. While the stew is simmering, I'm gonna prepare some meat. It's gonna be sausages, bratwurst to be precisely. Too nice pork sausages, I'm not going to add any seasoning because I got all the flavor in the stew it's just going to be plain in the pan is ready it looks beautiful it's completely slowly cooked just as I wanted it to be and the sausages are ready too time to plate things up mm. 
this looks good already. And then the final step to make this dish complete is adding a couple of spoons of pickle lily. Pickle lily of course is the English interpretation of the Indian pickles relish. I like it, many people like it here in the Netherlands and Belgium. Belgium they call it pickles. Pickle lily consists of pickles, carrots, cauliflower if I'm correct, lots of vinegar and mustard, lots of acidity which goes well you know this makes the freshness together with that creaminess of the soup so that is a perfect combination. I got my knife and fork, so that means I'm ready to eat. Oh yeah. Nice vegetable that is then, broccoli. The creaminess of the potatoes with the butter. That is nice. A little bit of acidity from the piccalini. Yeah, nice combination. curious about these sausages because I didn't season them. Do they have enough seasoning from their own? That is quite nice. Decent bratwurst. Stoop and pick a lily all in one bite. Very nice. I stew this stoop for a long time. Let it simmer and add some water. And this improves the quality of the stump. It's a nice piece of bratwurst. Now that is a nice fatty pork sausage, not too much fat, but really flavorsome. This is a perfect blending of flavors. I love this kind of easy food. Just a couple of potatoes, some vegetables. Yeah, you know, vegetables as you choose. What you want, you put in there and that's too. 
thank you for watching this video i see you in the next one and remember keep enjoying your food like i do